Hey up, it's Thailand Streetwalks and I'm out and about in Bang Bua Tong which is non tabari in Thailand and uh, I'm outside this big Chinese temple here Look at that everybody, out in the boonies, Bang Bua Tong. Let's uh, have a look along here and see what we can see. This is uh, it's not too far from Bang Yai this is, uh, area Bang Bua Tong. I don't really know this uh, area, it's kind of like uh, off the beaten track for me. But uh, you can see over there. Whatever that is, is that a little bit of development going on over there? Okay, here's some of the uh, local Thai guys just uh, shooting the breeze, so to speak. And we're just going to go on a little bit further here because we can see some uh, authentic Thai street life. What's this place over here? Yeah, yeah this is... Uh, some kind of authentic street life here, so yeah, this is a first for me. Oh. Okay, some nice dinky little shops here around this area. Look at this, and uh, where are all the locals? Sadi crab. <laughs> okay, and uh, people eat down here. Now let's walk on a little bit further, shall we? Let's see. And a meat wagon! Okay, that's a little bit further down here. Okay. Wow. What a place, eh? Bang Bua Tong. Okay. We are just on what looks like uh, main road here in Bang Bua Tong and I'm uh, going to take a walk down here and see what I can see. Okay, there's definitely quite a lot of uh, traffic in this place and we've got some small soys over there. Yeah, we had, uh, I've just come down here with my wife and we're in the car and we had uh, a bit of a problem parking around here because uh, it's a bit busy and there's not too many uh, parking slots but we found a place over here and she's just getting herself some food while I do a little bit of filming. Isn't this a quaint old town? Look at that, you've got a tuk-tuk there. Tuk-tuk, whee! Yes. Let's uh, have a walk over this bridge. Yeah, I don't really uh, know this area. So I have worked around here years ago, but not in this particular area because uh, Tong kind of covers a fair distance around here. So I'd say I'm not that familiar with it. And uh, 
we're coming up to a bit of a canal over there that's running through this like uh, main high street so let's check it out in the distance you can see a tower i don't know what that is but we'll be coming to it soon and uh, just check out this scene here yeah somebody fishing down there hey you caught something Oh, blah. <laughs> he's seen me filming him okay so let's carry on a little bit further and uh, carry on down here Whee. and uh, check out over here check out these scenes here the streets are very very narrow around here and it seems like even though we're in May there seems to be quite a lot of activity Oh, and uh, if you want, just check out that nice little pad over there on the river. Very cheap, 500 baht a month. Okay, let's uh, carry on, shall we? I want to know what that tower is in the distance. So uh, I'm going to uh, take us over there pretty sharpish. Yes, I'm super curious about that, what it's all about, a tower like that. obviously you can't go up in it but uh, it reminds me of the uh, tower in Sue Pambury obviously a lot smaller than that but kind of modeled roughly the same so uh, let's have a walk down here shall we this looks like uh, the main place to uh, get vans from around here there we go Bangu Atong Patumtani van there so these are little transporters and uh, just check out that and that's where everybody sits in there I remember one of these little transporters uh, whew, years ago like this uh, I was in uh, Petchaboon province and they were full up with people on both sides uh, on both of these benches here. it was full up and uh, I had to stand on the back there and hang on to this. And it was a 30 minute drive from Lom Sak down to Petchaboon province. And I hung on it, I thought I'd be all right. The guy must have been going about 60 miles an hour. My bag was on the back and I was hanging on for my dear life. I was absolutely, well, I'll tell you something. I needed uh, fresh underpants that day. That's uh, how scared I was. Is it, honestly, he, he, the foot, his foot went to the metal he put his foot down all the way now just check out that up there and this place here it's the cop shop isn't it it's a little uh, police box okay let's have a walk around here yeah i'll uh, i'll never forget that little uh, incident i was literally hanging on for my life i couldn't get inside because it was so full but uh, more the fool me for jumping on the back there i just thought it'd be like a tent a 10 minute ride to uh, Petchaboon and uh, I didn't think the guy would like go put his foot down you know so those were two variables that uh, I didn't uh, take into account so, look at those quaint little streets around there little back streets check those out lots of life around here wow isn't that just amazing Let's go on a little bit further, shall we? And uh, what have we got here? Tanun Tesa Ban Sam. Okay, so we're going to walk down here. Make sure I don't walk on the inside. It's the outside that I'm supposed to be walking on. And we've got lots of little food vendors here. And check out the fish there. Okay. And uh, you get free flies. <laughs> free meat. <laughs> A few flies that they're chucking for free. Okay. Plenty of places around here. The uh, Ran Tong, the gold shop here. Uh, you see those everywhere in Thailand, very, very popular. Uh, apparently Thais love their gold. I'm not a great expert on gold, but uh, I think Thai gold and uh, gold from other countries is, you know, the purity is slightly different. 
Uh, if you know anything about it, let me know in the comments below. So I do crab and yang I bang. Come on, come video. I need Ben, what do you want? Bang Bua Tong, Thai man. Thai crab. From UC Bang Yan. My friend, I come to the Dern Pai crab. Okay, so I do crab. Okay, so we've got some friendly locals there. And we've got uh, lots of uh, fruit here. Check all this out. And you can go down there as well. Uh, I think some of the stores are closed down there, so this place probably hots up at uh, night. And uh, what's this vendor got here? Okay, check those out. Do a Roy Magloy. And we've got the uh, legendary Jurian here on sale all over Thailand. I've noticed something now. Um, when I started buying the Jurian a few weeks ago, because we're uh, in the Jurian season, I think the Jurian season only lasts uh, a couple of months or something like that, a few weeks. I'm not sure, uh, but it doesn't last forever. I noticed that the prices, especially around Bang Yai, were about 130 baht a kilo, and the most expensive uh, price was probably about 160 baht a kilo. But I've noticed that prices have been jumping up over the last few weeks. I've seen Jorian uh, as expensive around Bang Yai as 200 baht a kilo. So the prices do go up apparently. Okay, so nice little hive of activity. I'll tell you something, check this out. I wouldn't mind living around here, I tell you. It's just got a, it's got a kind of like, uh, country feel to it but we're not quite in the country if you know what i mean we're we're out in the boonies a little bit we're not but we're not quite in the country and it's got a kind of like uh country village kind of feel to it so and i bet i bet you i bet the places around here i bet you could rent a decent house really cheaply around here so you know if you're thinking about moving to thailand and uh you want to live somewhere you might want to check out this area ah uh, okay let's carry on a little bit further here and uh, we're going to cross over the street here and we're going to check out the other side let's see if i can cross over the street always a challenge in thailand that is uh, it looks like this is going to be like a super challenge but Oh dear, there's a meat wagon. I don't want to uh, end up in there. So I'm walking down the middle of the street like a right momo. Okay, right, I'm across the road now. And uh, check out that. That was a little bit of a hair raising moment then. Whew. I tell you, it is getting a little bit warm. And uh, I've not seen any. Uh, Barangs around this area yet. So it looks like me be the only white guy in town. Uh, we've got the uh, barbers over there. Stuff like that. So the usual stuff, like I say, it's got a, a nice kind of uh, country, small country village feel about it around here. Uh, people seem pretty friendly in that. So, huh. I should uh, should ask my wife to move around here. Uh, you can just check out the tower from there. Can you see that? Yeah. Okay. Let's uh, move on a little bit further. Notice that there's lots of uh, water dropping off the roof. It must have been raining around here before. So, yeah. Very interesting little hive of activity around here. And we've got uh, the shops and everything around here. Very nice. Okay. some uh, ATMs here so you can get your cash and that street's got virtually everything what's that old saloon so over old salon over there sorry yeah so it's got virtually everything 
around here you've got uh, your drivers and everything <laughs> yeah everybody around here seems uh, quite friendly and that they're up for a laugh yeah, what a place uh, and that's your police box over there and uh, we're just gonna check out this another eatery here uh, it goes back and goes back and goes back and goes back and uh, what food have they got for sale Ooh, some small sausages hmm Yeah, this is Ghoul Roti Cafe in Bang Bua Tong. And uh, there we go. Check out this. And uh, before I leave, we just popped in for some roti. Let's check that out. What do you think of that? Over there. And you put these, eat your roti with these here. Got a milk drink there, so anyway, I'm hungry, so I'm gonna eat. Dear, dear. It's, uh, uh, a little ginnel through to the next street around there, so I do cab. Yeah, it's uh, a very friendly feel around here. It's probably, like I say, they don't see too many Farangs around this area. Yeah. Let's just have a look down here. We've got uh, selling gas stoves and that. Yeah. onto the bridge that's just about it for this video uh, thank you very much for coming along and uh, I'll see you in another video and remember as always uh, give it a big thumbs up like subscribe and comment below let me know see you later bye